guys, this is Adulam Experience YouTube channel, an interdenominational channel with life changing word of God. We believe the video you're about to watch will transform your life. If this is your first time on this channel, kindly subscribe and click on the notification bell to get you notified when we post new videos. Thank you. And the guy checked and he checked. And it was it was 120 over 80. He said, "Come on, that's not true. It's something wrong with my machine. I gotta check it again. Check your machine again and check." Will I allow? And only what happens to God can happen to me. Do you see why? Even when sickness comes, we are bold. The other time I was traveling back to back every week, and a friend of mine came from the U.S. and he looked at me and said, "Oh, brother, you you're so stressed." Come on, it's not okay. I want to check your BP. Let's be sure you're fine. I said, well, it's right. We don't underrate or undermine natural law. Check. He now checked. And the BP was over 160, above 99. He said, Jesus, you should be in the hospital now. I said, wow, I need rest. But for now, let there be a quick intervention. And I looked at myself. I say in the name of Jesus, blood pressure, go down to normal. In the name of Jesus, blood pressure, go down to normal. In the name of Jesus, blood pressure, go down to normal. I said, check again. It's not go gone. It's not tomorrow. It's not later. It said, now faith is. Now faith is. And the guy checked. And he checked. And it was, it was 120 over 80. He said, come on, that's not true. It's something wrong with my machine. I got to check it again. Check your machine again and check. He changed the battery from the machine and he checked again. It was 120 over 80. He checked in the evening, 120 over 80. He checked the next day, 120 over 80. Because I will not undermine natural law, I took a break to rest. But I also know that when the natural law cannot be obeyed, we download the supernatural law. Four days ago, I went somewhere with my wife and they said, Hey, man of God, you, you are so stressed. Can you check? I said, check. We have addressed that thing some years ago. We don't need to do it twice. And they checked. It was 124 over 80. It has to remain there. Because when we talk, we change things. You see, a righteous man does not talk because he wants to speak. He said the effectual, fervent prayer of the righteous man availeth much. It makes dynamic power. Dynamic power. That's why I told you, righteousness is power. When we talk, we are cooking power. Dynamic power. Available. Don't make us talk. We can create and we can destroy. Not because we are apostles, but because we are righteous men. We are righteous men. We are righteous men. It's on the strength of righteousness that you can tell yourself, as he is, so am I in this world. And so what he does, I do. In fact, Jesus took the scale higher. In John 14, 12, he said, the works that I do, greater, greater, greater. Oh, dear Lord. Somebody is about to be intoxicated. I'm no longer afraid. Devil, throw your best shot. Throw your best shot. For I'm more than a conqueror. Greater is he that is in me than he that is in the world. You're blessed by the video you just watched. If this is your first time on this channel, kindly subscribe and click on the notification bell. Thank you.